Hello friends, welcome to my new vlog. Uh, today we are going to do another food review. We have come at a place called Chomp Chomp Food Center. It is uh, near Serangoon, but it's not exactly near Serangoon. It's in Kensington Park Road. Uh, we will, I'll give you the address uh, uh, exactly down below in my description box. The nearest MRT is uh, the Serangoon MRT, but it's not so near. It's around uh, half an hour from here. So let's get inside and see what's the famous about here. So we reached here a little early today. Uh, it opens at four o'clock, uh, but we just waited for five minutes and it opened up. So first thing we ordered is the barbecue stingray, which was uh, which is kind of pretty famous here. The owner of the shop was very nice. He uh, let me inside the kitchen to shoot. They have this collection of the fresh uh, seafood there in that stall. Uh, we just ordered it from the stall number 101. So what they exactly do is they put a generous amount of uh, chili sambal into a banana leaf. Then they put the uh, stingray into it. On top of it, they, again, they put a paste of uh, chili sambal and then they fold it and put it into the hot tawa or the hot oven and then they cover it up so it gets an effect of a barbecue or not even a barbecue but it gets an effect of a baking and it cooks inside that cover. So this place is another a hawker center but it's a quite it's quite small hawker center but they have got varieties of options and it their options are quite different from the other hawker centers you get you get loads of seafoods here uh, satay and there are some other options as well which i will just go around and take a look so this is our barbecue stingray uh, it has got uh, some fresh onions and also calamansi. And this is calamansi. Calamansi is kind of a lime, uh, but it has kind of like a cross between an orange and a lime. So it has got a flavor of the orange and also the sourness of the lime. Uh, this is a sauce which is kind of like an onion and lime and some chili into it. Let me just, let me just try this. It's really good. The fish, uh, it, it tastes more taste like a meat and less fishy. So I'll just take one more bite and I'll tell you. So it tastes more like a chicken breast but it's more juicy and it's more flaky so it, it definitely doesn't taste like i mean if i don't tell you that it's a fish you probably won't recognize that this is a fish let me put some fresh calamansi into it i'll not taste it after i have put in the calamansi i'll put an onion also It is really good once you put the calamansi into it, it changes the flavors in a different dimension altogether. So we have just ordered some uh, satay, uh, combination of chicken and mutton. And also we have ordered some chicken wings. The chicken wings were looking really tempting, so I couldn't resist myself when it's ordered. This center opens at four o'clock in the afternoon and it runs till midnight. So it's, it's a perfect place if you want to have some of your midnight craving, you can come here. If you, if you live in the nearby locality, then it's a perfect place to have some good food in the midnight. So these are the chicken wings and these are the satay. So the chicken wings are nicely cut into halves. They have provided this uh, sauce. It's probably a chili and lime and tomato sauce. So I'll just try one wing without any sauce. It's, it's, it's nice and juicy. It's very juicy. It, it's perfectly cooked and the wings are really fleshy and really juicy. Now I'll just try this uh, with the sauce. I like it more without the sauce. It has got its original taste without the sauce. 
This is the satay. Uh, these are the chicken satay. And these are the mutton satay. They have also provided a sauce, which is mostly a peanut sauce. It's kind of a little sweet, but it tastes really good along with the satay. Let me first try the satay uh, just as it is without the sauce. I got the whole thing in one bite. Now let me try the mutton satay. Hmm. Both are good. The marination probably is the same for both of them, but the meat is good in both of them. I, I like both of them. If you want, if you want me to compare, I cannot. Both are good. I will just try one with the sauce and let's see what difference does it make. Hmm. With the sauce, it becomes a little more sweet, but it changes the taste um, in different ways. So it's up to you whether you want to have it along with the sauce or want to have it just like that. I would like it without the sauce, but it's your personal preference. So out of all the three items that we had here, that is the stingray, the satay, and also the chicken wings, the stingray is way, way better. The stingray steals the show. This is the best stingray I had in Singapore ever. I had stingrays in, in East Coast seafood centers, but this was way better. We just we just finished our food. Uh, the barbecue stingray cost us eighteen dollars. We had ordered the largest one, so the lowest one was ten, and then it was sixteen, and then it was eighteen. The combination of the chicken wings, four piece of chicken wings, and a ten piece of satay, it costed us twelve dollars. So overall, the entire food or the entire meal costed us thirty dollars. So with a food of this nature, thirty dollars is quite reasonable and it's quite good. I hope you all liked this and enjoyed this video. If you have liked it, really give it a thumbs up because that really matters. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and subscribe to it so that you get the notifications of all the interesting food videos and travel videos that I put into the channel. So we'll see you all in my next video. Till then, stay safe, stay healthy.